Sydney Harbour, the envy of all other harbours around the world. You can easily spend the majority of your trip here and leave with a great experience. It's home to Sydney's most famous attractions, the Harbour Bridge and the Opera House. And at the centre of it all, Circular Quay, a bustling promenade connecting the two that's alive with street performers, shops and restaurants. Circular Quay is like a powerful magnet that draws in both tourists and locals, not only for these beautiful views of the harbor, but it's also the perfect place to take a stroll or just hang out in a restaurant and people watch. It's the heartbeat of the city. Let's see the world, you and me. Let's see the world like no one ever has seen before. Let's find what we've been missing this whole time. Climbing to the top of Harbour Bridge is something I've always wanted to do, and it does look really fun. You could see people scaling the top up there, but when I found out it cost over $200 to take that tour, Yeah, you know it really cheeses me off when these Americans come over and they think they can take over the... They're feeding natural habitat. These are our prized possessions, the kangaroo and the seagull. And just because they want to do the Finding Nemo thing, we invented it. The Sydney Opera House is known for its symbolic design, with its sail-like structure dominating the harbour, ready to cast out into the world. See if I can find an escalator. The Opera House is one of the most iconic buildings in the world. And if you want to, you can pay some money and take a guided tour inside or come back at night and see a concert. But the real thrill for me is just to be outside to see the structure itself and just walking around the building taking pictures, I mean, that's, that's what you really want to come here for.